I am Jade Thirlwall and you're watching Mariners TV. Jordan, in a similar way to Saturday, a lot of positives to take from that game, but the result wasn't the positive one that you were looking for. What's your take on the game overall? Yeah, like you said, um, there was a lot of similarities to Saturday in that we played the way we wanted to play. Uh, we carved them open at times. We're just obviously missing that, that last clinical, you know, that touch or that, that maybe that ball across. Um, I think when it when it does come for us and when we do get that first goal, I'm very confident the lads will just start putting three, four away each game. I was going to say, it's a bit of a cliche in there, but when you get that one goal, you must feel like you can push on now and some team is going to take hide when it really does click up there. Yeah, we've seen times of last season when, you know, we'd, we'd absolutely demolish teams and, and, you know, it would come out like it would tonight, like a nil-nil draw. But there'd be other times where, you know, we, we'd come out 5-0, 4-0, something like that in the first half. Um, so I just think once we can, can click and the lads... I don't know, like we said, we, all of us, we, once we can find that, that last ball and that last pass, we'll, I think we'll just thrive and, and go on from there. Much from the sidelines, it seemed like a very feisty game. I think 14 yellow cards in it overall. <laughs> it was a bit ridiculous number, really, but what was it like to play in? Yeah, it felt feisty to play in as well. You know, tackles are flying around, but that's what we expected to the local derby. Um, expect that from the sidelines with the fans and, and everything. It's obviously a shame that we couldn't have the full capacity in because I think it would have made for an even, even better um, game. But... You know, that's what you expect the Derby to be and I wouldn't really want it any other way. Well, a couple of games against Mortal the last year we probably felt in, in those games as well. Do you really feel that rivalry when you're playing against them? You do. Obviously, before I came here, I, I didn't really know the rivalry or the story behind um, why the rivalry is so big. Um, but I think my, my first game against them was away last year. I felt it straight away. And then I think I felt it even more tonight here. Um, you know, it's really good to see. In terms of the points, I'm sure you're not where you want to be at the moment. How, how eager are you to sort of get a run together now and really start pushing up that table? Yeah, uh, I mean, we can play as well as we are doing, but then if we don't get the three points, it's, that's the most important thing. So we do need to, to try and go on a run now, um, starting on Saturday. And then obviously, we've got FC United on, on Tuesday, so if we can just pick up six points on those two games, I know one's FA Cup, but you know, if we can get on a run, I'm confident that we'll find ourselves right at the top of the table. On Saturday, it's FC Halifax here, obviously a National League team, a chance to really pick your wits against a strong side from a couple of divisions above. The players must be really relishing that opportunity. Of course, that's what we, you know, that's what we're in the FA Cup for. We want to get as far as possible against the against playing against sides that are, you know, leagues higher than, than Halifax, and if we can. Um, so I know the lads will be buzzing for Saturday after tonight um, because it is a chance to test yourselves against against you know players where we want to be. We want to, like, evidently in the end we want to be in the National League, so. I think it's going to be a good, good test for us, uh, but one that I definitely think we can, we can win. Just finally, the prize on Saturday is obviously placed in the first round of the FA Cup, but placing a draw along the legs, alongside the legs of Portsmouth, Ipswich, Sunderland, obviously. Yeah. How big would that be for the club, do you think, to get through that game and get through to the first round? I think it would be massive. Obviously, we'll focus on, on Saturday first, because if we don't win on Saturday, we don't get to, to be in the hat for the, that massive draw. Um, if we can get there, you know, obviously the funding is brilliant. Um, but the lads would absolutely love a tie, you know, maybe a waiter, like a Portsmouth or, or something like that, it'd be huge.